Today we're joining forces with the new Captain America the First Avenger figure. And sharing some of the amazing first to play sweepstakes entries. Uh, I want to go ahead and tell you what I love about Disney Infinity. And we're jumping into the grid with Sam Flint. Alright guys, so this week we are super excited to... What are you doing, Allison? I'm just bashing some bosses in the Playbox 3.0 mobile app. Take that! <laughs> you guys are no match for a pumpkin frying pan. Very true. For those of you watching, we just had the release of the Toy Box 3.0 mobile app for iOS, Android, and Amazon devices. And I guess, Allison, I'll excuse you this time for not paying attention to our fans that are watching. Oh, oops. <laughs> All right, and speaking of new stuff, we just announced a new patriotic figure with a familiar face. Let's dive in and take a look. Let's do it. Today, we're going to be revealing new details about the Marvel playset, Marvel Battlegrounds. We're excited to announce that the Marvel Battlegrounds playset comes with... Drum roll, please. I swear I'm gonna trash this one day. <laughs> Captain America, the first Avenger. Ooh. Captain America's back with a new look in Disney Infinity 3.0. Not only that, but this figure's got brand new moves and animations, plus a new super move. Now this is a medium range character, which is useful if you like fighting both up close and also from a distance. And he is extremely acrobatic, which proves very useful in battle. He puts his shield to good use too. Different from his 2.0 figure. So guys, if you're going to be at New York Comic Con this weekend, be sure to attend or tune in to our live stream panel at 4 p.m. Eastern Time. We're going to have a ton of people on our panel, including people from Marvel, United Front Games, and Avalanche, plus us, to discuss the Marvel Battlegrounds playset. That's right, and check back next week where we'll also be talking with creative director of Marvel Games, Bill Roseman, to get a closer look at the Marvel Battlegrounds playset. Bill is totally awesome, and you guys are not going to want to miss out, so make sure you tune back in next week. So the Sam Flynn figure is out right now, guys, and he's got an awesome moveset inside of Disney Infinity 3.0. Yeah, he's got some pretty cool looking attacks. He uses his identity disc to fight both close range and from a distance. What I love about Sam Flynn is how he has the ability to summon his light cycle at any point for a quick getaway. Well, JV, you may use it for running away, but I use it for more practical things. Well, whatever, sick burn, Allison, like what? Like taking down my enemies. The light wall that comes out of the back actually damages foes as well. Yeah, and you know his special move, which is called Son of Flynn is pretty epic too. Sam Flynn holds his identity disc up in the air, which then surrounds him with a kind of digital jazz man that knocks foes on their back. So actually, the Toy Box Ventures made a character adventure toy box designed just for Sam Flynn. Want to take a look? Yeah. In this toy box, titled Tron Legends, Sam Flynn's Story, Edward Dillinger Jr. has introduced a new AI into the grid as part of his new master plan. Investigate Dillinger's office to discover that his plans are more sinister than it once originally thought, and Sam Flynn and Cora must enter the grid once more. This toy box is part of a dual story adventure. Inside the grid, Sam Flynn and Cora must split up. Sam Flynn must first battle his way through the grid's wastelands. Once you make it to a ravaged city, you must fight off the attackers there to gain more info on this new AI. Finally, you're gonna hop onto a light cycle and make your way to an obstacle littered bridge to the arena where you get to fight an intense battle with Dillinger's latest creation. Then meet up with Korra to escape the grid. It's all to be continued though, right? That's right, this story will continue in Tron Legends Korra's story, which will be released at a later date. For now though, you can download Tron Legends Sam Flynn's story from developer picks in the game or from the Disney Infinity website under Top Toy Box. And don't forget, you need to have a Sam Flynn figure to play. Throughout September, 100 lucky fans won the first to play sweepstakes, and they received a D23 exclusive Kingdom Hearts Mickey Power Disc. We saw some pretty awesome videos from you guys who entered, so we just want to say thanks to everybody who submitted one for us to check out. And we put together a reel of some of your favorite moments from your guys' videos. Let's check it out. Hi, this is Brandon, also known as Flame Champion 267 and this is our entry for the first to play Disney Infinity 3.0 sweepstakes. This is Chase, and he's going to be unboxing. Obi-Wan Kenobi. Alright, go for it. There's uh, Yoda and Ahsoka and Obi-Wan and Anakin. 
and one of my childhood favorites from Tron, the new film remake, we have Sam Flynn. Just picked up Disney Infinity 3.0 guys, we're gonna all so now that we've opened these up, why don't we go ahead and maybe play some? Yep, let's go! Thanks guys for watching this episode of Toy Box TV. The Toy Box Expansion Games, Toy Box Takeover, and the Toy Box Speedway will finally be available next Tuesday, and we'll be playing them live on Toy Box TV. Can't wait! Yeah. And don't forget, this is your last chance to get your Toy Box in for the platforming challenge. Submissions are due tomorrow at noon Pacific time. Be sure to check back tomorrow for a brand new episode of Tips and Tricks as well, and then back again on Thursday for the first ever Top 5 Countdown for Disney Infinity 3.0. We'll see you next time. Yeah, and remember guys, if you can dream it, you can do it.